Boston's North End neighborhood is a unique and historic area known for its narrow streets, bustling, lively atmosphere, and delicious Italian eats. In this video, I will be sharing some of the pros and cons of living in the North End that you will not find in other videos, articles, or guides. My name is Charlie Smith, a real estate agent and advisor with expertise in the North End, condo buildings, luxury homes, and new construction properties. I assist individuals from all over Massachusetts, the United States, and other countries in finding homes for living or investment purposes. If you have any questions about the North End, relocating to the Boston area, or real estate in general, you can find my contact information in the description of this video. To give a brief background, the North End is located in the top middle half of Boston. The North End became an Italian-American enclave starting in the mid-1800s, reflecting the larger wave of Italian immigrants sailing to the U.S. The North End is well known for its narrow streets, lined with brick buildings, historic churches, and some of the best Italian restaurants in the city and country. The neighborhood is right on Boston's waterfront, offering amazing views of the harbor and easy access to Boston's Harbor Walk for walking or jogging. In terms of demographics, the North End neighborhood has changed greatly over the years and at the moment is quite popular with young professionals. The neighborhood does have a solid population of retirees and those who grew up in the area as well. The median home value in the North End as of 2022 was 850000 which is higher than the median home value in Boston as a whole. This, however, is lower than Back Bay, Downtown, and Boston Seaport District. The average rent in 2022 was around 3400 a month. The majority of housing in the North End consists of condos with a mix of one, two, and three bedroom units. One of the most notable buildings is Battery Wharf, which is a full-service luxury waterfront property offering residents stunning views of the harbor. The building features a full-service concierge, fitness center, spa, and garage parking. Another prestigious condo building in the North End is the Mariner, which is a newly constructed luxury development that offers a contemporary living experience. The building features floor-to-ceiling windows, high-end finishes, and a rooftop terrace with views of Boston's skyline and harbor. Also, the Strata 234, which is a modern, full-service building that offers residents amenities such as valet parking, 24-hour concierge, and a fitness center. This building is located just steps away from the very popular Hanover Street. The Union Wharf is another luxury condo building that was converted from a warehouse. The building features exposed brick and beams, hardwood floors, and harbor views. Several other North End condo buildings include the Lincoln Wharf, the Prince, and the Folio, each offering unique features and amenities for residents. The neighborhood also has a strong sense of community with many residents actively involved in local events and organizations. There are numerous events which take place throughout the year, which I will address later in this video. According to Niche, the median age is 35 years old, and 81% of adults living in the North End neighborhood have earned at least a bachelor's degree. Top occupations for those living in the North End are business finance, management, and sales-related positions with a growing trend of those who work in the tech and biotech industries. The median income in the North End is $120,000. North End residents aged 25 to 44 typically earn $124,000, while those between the ages of 45 and 64 years old have a median wage of $170,000. The North End has some of Boston's most famous restaurants, bars, and eateries. Some of the best Italian food and pastries can be found here with so many different offerings. The North End dining scene is a clear pro when it comes to living here. One of the most popular spots in the neighborhood is Regina Pizzeria, which has been serving pizza since 1926. For a modern twist on Italian cuisine, there is Terra, which offers contemporary Italian dishes made with locally sourced ingredients. The Daily Catch is another great spot that specializes in Sicilian-style calamari and seafood pasta dishes. For casual meals and sandwiches, there is Monica's Mercado, which has great Italian subs. In terms of bars, the North End has plenty of options to choose from. The famous Bell and Hand Tavern, established in 1795, is one of the oldest bars in the country. For a newer, more modern atmosphere, there is also Ward 8, a bar that serves up creative drinks and small plates. Another popular spot is the Bostonia Public House, which offers a more upscale atmosphere and a wide range of craft cocktails and local beers. In terms of bakeries and pastries, the most well-known bakery in the North End, and maybe in the U.S., is Mike's Pastry, which has been a staple in the neighborhood since 1946. This bakery is famous for its cannolis, but they also have a wide range of other pastries, cookies, and cakes. 
The lines at Mike's Pastry can be long, especially during peak tourist season, but it's worth the wait. Another popular bakery in the North End is Modern Pastry, which has been around since 1930. Modern Pastry is known for its high quality ingredients and traditional recipes. The North End and Boston Waterfront are home to a variety of community events and clubs that include celebrations, gatherings, and parties dedicated to culture and food. Some of the most notable events in the North End are the annual festivals, including St. Anthony's Feast and the Fisherman's Feast. These events bring the community together to celebrate with parades, live music, and great Italian food. Boston's Harbor Fest is another annual event that takes place on the waterfront, featuring live music, food, and fireworks in celebration of Independence Day. For those interested in art, the North End Music and Performing Arts Center offers year-round concerts, theater performances, and other cultural events. During summer months, the Boston Harbor Hotel hosts free outdoor movie nights on the weekends, right on the wharf. For those who enjoy being on the water, the Boston Sailing Center provides lessons, racing, and recreational sailing right on the Boston Harbor. The North End Athletic Association is a community organization that provides youth sports leagues and community events throughout the year. Finally, Friends of the Boston Harbor Walk is a group of volunteers dedicated to maintaining and promoting the scenic Harbor Walk Trail that passes through the North End and other waterfront neighborhoods. These events and clubs provide opportunities for residents to get involved in the community. Boston's North End is situated in a prime location providing residents with easy access to various amenities, educational institutions, and job opportunities. Its central location and access to public transportation provide the ability to reach most places on foot or via the train. This accessibility is particularly attractive to students with several top-ranked universities such as MIT, Harvard, Berkeley, Northeastern, Suffolk, and Emerson being within 10 to 15 minutes away. Also, its proximity to downtown Boston's financial district, the Seaport District, Longwood Medical Area, and the various biotech life science labs make it an excellent spot for working professionals. The North End also offers a unique atmosphere that attracts both residents and visitors. The neighborhood has narrow streets, cobblestone alleyways, and 18th century architecture which add to the character and give the neighborhood a distinct feeling. Being right on Boston's harbor is also very appealing for residents given the scenic beauty of the harbor and surrounding areas with stunning views of the water, the city skyline, and historic landmarks like the USS Constitution and the Bunker Hill Monument. The waterfront also offers plenty of opportunities for outdoor recreation and activities with parks and green spaces such as Christopher Columbus Park and the Harbor Walk Trail that runs along the waterfront. Residents can take advantage of activities such as sailing, kayaking, and paddleboarding in the harbor. Another great asset in the North End is the Mirabella Pool, which is located on the waterfront and offers great views of Boston Harbor. The large outdoor swimming pool is open to the public and features a diving board, lap lanes, and a shallow area for children and is free to all residents of the North End. Adjacent to the pool are multiple basketball courts which are right on the water and also open to the public. The North End is right by Faneuil Hall Marketplace, which is a top destination for tourists and locals to enjoy various restaurants, shops, and a great food court. The Rose Kennedy Greenway divides the waterfront and the North End from downtown Boston and is another great green space to enjoy during all seasons. The North End has a lot of historical significance and is one of the most important areas in regards to U.S. history. The North End is one of the oldest neighborhoods in the city dating back to the 1600s. The neighborhood became home to many Italian immigrants in the late 1800s and early 1900s. Due to this, it has become a cultural hub for Italian-American heritage and is often referred to as Boston's Little Italy. The North End has played an important role in Boston's history, serving as the birthplace of many predominant figures and events. Notably, Paul Revere's house, which is now a museum, is located in the North End. Another being the Old North Church, which played an important role during the American Revolutionary War. Throughout the 19th and 20th centuries, the North End became a center of activity for immigrants arriving in Boston. As a result, the neighborhood is now home to many historic landmarks, including churches, schools, and other community institutions. The North End is very densely populated with narrow, winding streets that can make driving and parking a challenge. As mentioned, the North End is incredibly popular during the majority of the year. Due to this, at its central location, the North End experiences heavy traffic congestion, particularly during peak hours and especially during the summer months. Paying to park is also an additional expense per month, and many decide to get around via public transportation instead. If you really do prefer to have a spot, it's good to look at rentals or condos for sale that include a deeded parking spot. Additionally, the North End's narrow streets and one-way roads can make it confusing and difficult to navigate. It is not uncommon for drivers to get lost or find themselves stuck in traffic on the narrow streets. 
To navigate the north end more easily, many residents opt to use public transportation or use ride-sharing services instead. The neighborhood has several MVTA stations, including the Haymarket and North End Station, as well as multiple bus routes which make it super easy to get around. Biking and walking are also viable options as many of the neighborhood's attractions are within walking distance of each other and the North End's location is so central. The North End is undoubtedly a very lively and exciting neighborhood with many restaurants, bars, and nightlife options that cater primarily to adult tastes. While this makes it a great place for young professionals looking for a vibrant social scene, it may not be as appealing to families with young children. One of the primary drawbacks of the North End for families is the lack of kid-friendly activities within the neighborhood. While there are certainly parks and playgrounds nearby, the majority of the North End's attractions are catered towards adults. This can make it challenging for parents to find age-appropriate entertainment options for their kids. Statistically, the North End has a lower number of families than other comparable neighborhoods within the area. This can likely be attributed to the lack of public and private school options in the neighborhood. As mentioned, the North End streets can be narrow and congested, making it challenging for families with strollers or young children to navigate. While these things may make it less attractive to those with kids, Niche still rates the North End as an A for family friendliness. In conclusion, the North End is a unique and historic neighborhood with a rich cultural heritage. Residents have easy access to Boston's business districts and top educational institutions. The dynamic restaurant and nightlife scene as well as the benefits of the location make it a highly rated neighborhood. Whether you're considering the North End for living or investment purposes, it's important to weigh the pros and cons to make an informed decision. If you have any further questions or would like to discuss your specific real estate needs, feel free to contact me anytime. Thanks again for watching and be sure to check out my channel for information on Greater Boston, luxury condo buildings, and new construction properties.